We are coming to you live from Steeltown, Pennsylvania at the sold-out Three Mile Island Stadium. There's nothing quite like playing in the scenic toxic nuclear waste dump. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Leveland Burns take on the Blitzburg Steelheads. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hi again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with the only guy to ever get cut from the league for testing positive for not taking enough steroids or mutant growth hormones, Brickhead Mulligan. Hey, there was a reason for that. I had to quit taking steroids. My nutsack was shrinking, and I sprouted this mini-me on my shoulder. Bricks Jr., freak me out. You're a pussy. And it's first and ten. Crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on. Be careful! Trying to pick up a ball when it's in the middle of a bunch of bloody body parts is so unsanitary. I once tried to return a guy's kidney for a touchdown. Now that goes. The ref gave me one point since I spiked it and splattered the front row. Mistakes here, just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Oh, I love this dirty trick. G5 Bofum. Well, as a quarterback, you have to take risks and just chuck the ball sometime. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. First and ten. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. Second down and a lot. Reception. This quarterback is going to live. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? <laughs> and it's first and ten. secondary for you pay him for the pick six for this you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck second down and ten and that's perfect coverage nice deflection third down and ten the 
enough, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. First down and one. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and get the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called set. It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. leaving a wake of destruction in his path and the body toll continues to climb <laughs> the burn returner was maimed by the opposing team so it's up to the next man to replace him yeah what exactly is a burn returner grim you now players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense they have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league the next man And it's first and ten. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my offseason. And that'll be second down and four. And the quarterback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. <laughs> Third down and, well, good luck. They pick up a nice chunk of yards on that pass play. Oh, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. And like bricks his bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. And it's first and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Second down and more than the QB would like. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense. Oh, with the brain scrambler. First and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must... Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. Is that right, man? That penalty makes no sense. And it's something ain't kosher here, and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. First and goal. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. First down and six. I am a hell of 
Now. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And he punched his way out of that tackle. And it's first and ten. you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. Hey, just think, three years ago, Bricks, this robot was a fake ATM machine stealing millions. Now he's scoring in front of millions. That's NFL football, folks. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. First and ten. Pow! With the brain scrambler! Second down and ten. down and long. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburn, and he just wrestles away from that tackle. Is he dead? Uh, nah, he's still moving. Crap, I had money on him biting the big one. If he don't die soon, my loan shark is going to kill me. And it's first and ten. Watching out for that dirty trick. Second down and ten. Third down and the punter is warming up. Freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. The ref goes a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot 
He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. And, now that is weird side effects, Bricks. He scores! With kickers, you never know. It's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. brain cells before that hit they're gone now he's gonna have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit second down in a very lot at this rate the QB is gonna have more interceptions than completions oh look at this guy break tackles and he's off to the races and he scores now this guy looks kind of familiar yeah he was in that 80s band Men with For a guy 100 years old, <laughs> he's aged better than Keith Richards. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. And it's first and ten. down in a lot. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know how much throw. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make it. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. Yep. He's coming out in the field now. Second down and nine. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Well, 
little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. One. That run is good for nine yards. Second and one. I won. I two. I it burst down. He hit that line the way a rolled up dollar bill sticking out of flimsy low hands nose. It's a mare in lost wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. I oh man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one. Hot. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more receptions than the other. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. First and ten. And he picks up two yards on the catch. And that'll be second and eight to go. I hope you covered your ears. And that's how you shock the monkey. Thunderclap. Finds open space is running toward the end zone. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Uh, this is a really violent game, guys. Oh, oh, he did not see that coming. The offense is down to their last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Huge pass play for one yard. Second down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. down and well hot, good luck hot one hot two hot, hot. well it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it you gotta keep your eye on the ball come on you dirtbag you gotta make that catch boring but smart time to punt whoa whoa you can't say that on the radio and he booted a high arcing rainbow he's got the ball now and is gonna try and score Oh, he just got crushed. And the offense goes into the hurry up formation to try to conserve time. No one was interested in that incomplete pass. Eh, not a boss feelings at height. Hey, don't make me explain that balls don't have emotions again, all right? The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up? Oh, and he just turns ginormous. Look out! Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's...
Giants first and ten. And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blasphemy. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. And it's the quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's Matt's stupid time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? They get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries. Makers of great killer products like Ground Up. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. We're back for the second half in a blowout. The teams line up for the kickoff. What a game is this close as the score indicates. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Does the QB know which team? Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. And it's first and ten. Looks like the defense hit. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. He's 
rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, and imagine a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Ah, another interception. He did it. He scores. And with that amazing run, he first. The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, his head just exploded. First down in less than a year. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho. Crowd's loving it. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Serve those runners now and consider passing more. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way. And they stack the line, and he gets this bell run for you. Uh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. Yeah, Second down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. I personally think the ginormous guy is coming. When the coach said the offense was going to be explosive this week, he meant it literally. Third down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. And 
And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Right the dog thing, snags. He got to play a car. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot for a four-yard gain. Second down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And the quarterback throws another pick. Boom! Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but yeah, not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. <laughs> well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And the defense gets another pick. Good night, Irene. You ever get hit in the face with a shovel, Graham? I have. And trust me, the hit that guy just took was worse. And 
and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Now, I'm not sure who he was throwing to on that play. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called set straight through the uprights. <laughs> the home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Oh, and that's what it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all he knocked out like that. I'd have to meet at the dice grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> Second down and long. He may not be able to comprehend math that ref that just called that penalty. He was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings. That sounds like a good job. He's right at home here taking money from coaches, players, and fans. I even saw him swipe the money from the bathroom attendant. Yeah, who don't do that? And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Defense gets the quarterback for a sack. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Britch's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a compliment. And he's off to the races. The 20. The 10. Oh, what a run there. Touchdown. No one was going to stop him. <laughs> and they line up for the extra point. right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The onside kick is a desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a possession. Stealing ain't right, Glenn. It just ain't right. Perfect kick and recovery by the kicking team. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch! The 
Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just... Defense lost another line basher on that play, and only two remain on the roster. Their defense is getting very close to forfeiting this game. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And let the work speed dirty trick. Look at him go. Like he just ran into the line at the DM. Bingo, bingo. I just hit that mutant bingo. And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Ground game is starting to soften up. Oh, mama. Just call him Captain Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And it's first and ten. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. Second down and five. Third down and long. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and, uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense. And he just presses away from that pass was good for 10 yards. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. They could not connect on that play. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, man, what's the hurry-up offense? This guy's a brick shithouse. Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And that pass play is good for eight yards. 
third and two. And he was steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. And that's why he's a defense, schmuck. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. How they take it to the air and pick up a fourth down conversion? Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. He's not, he's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. Yo, seriously, man, if you can go toe to toe with me, I will wreck your world. You understand me, Juni? I'll wreck your world. And here comes the extra point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. Two. And an eight yard gain on that one. Like when Bricks' mom decided to move back in with us. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Oh man, Bricks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the NFL. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? Red, can I... Wow, he took like a thousand points a shot there. They did that to my Aunt Lizzie because she thought she was the reincarnation of Lizzie Ford and the Ant Smiler. Did the shot treatment work? Well, after she killed four of the doctors and Zephyr, they never bothered her again. So, yeah, I guess it worked for her. And it's first and ten. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They just be called sinners then. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. 
He sits up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about bad hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. He's at the 40. The 30. Oh, so close, but not today. The offense lost their last receiver on that play. Next time their offense comes out on the field, they will have to forfeit. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that, Graham. Oh, boy. Second down and ten. Try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just... The Blitzburg Steelheads decimate the opposition today and win by forfeit. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about it? Shut the hell up right now. We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Heart Corporation. They get it right every up.